Yeah, you've probably seen the photo before. Remember this selfie of the grinning monkey a few years back? Well, today, those photos ended up before the federal appeals court here in San Francisco. It's all at the heart of a long running copyright case. As KPI X5's Emily Turner reports, it's a battle between monkey and man over who owns those photos. His name is Naruto, and he shot to stardom after taking these selfies on a wildlife photographer's camera. But his lasting impression will be made in federal court, where those attorneys are arguing over who owns the copyright to those photos, man or monkey. There's never been a case where uh, an animal or a non-human has been given the rights of a copyright holder. So that's why PETA is pursuing it, to, to extend the rights of animals just a little bit for, further. If PETA wins its appeal, Naruto will be the trailblazer, although judges are still uncertain why an American-based organization is filing on behalf of an Indonesian monkey's business. How is there an allegation in the complaint that PETA is a qualified next friend of the monkey Naruto? so that PETA can represent Naruto. PETA argues the macaque monkey should own the copyright for his selfies, saying he's a cognizant creature that can feel and be creative who intended to push the camera button. We think that fundamentally uh, the law of copyright should apply to Naruto equally. He undeniably took these photographs, um, and the copyright law is clear. He who takes the photographs owns them. But does that he apply to apes? especially when an artist set it up. That could open up a lot of uh, interesting avenues as to where the law could lead. That's why I think where the, uh, certainly on the defendant side, they're saying this, this should be limited. If the primate gets the copyright, PETA says it will administer the proceeds from selling the image, all of which would fund preservation of the endangered monkey species. But the other side argues an animal-owned copyright creates its own threat legally. Uh, monkey see, monkey sue will not do in federal court. A judge initially sided with that argument, but PETA appealed it, making their rebuttal in court this morning. So whether private, public, or primate, the photo copyright's final owner will be decided in three months to a year. In San Francisco, Emily Turner, KPIX 5.